can only be friends with women that are full of themselves because if you get around me you're gonna feel intimidated if you're not really confident in yourself my world revolves around me and if you're gonna get intimidated by that we can't be friends i'm one of those people who act like i'm in a tv show every day all day and that's okay because i surround myself with friends that just let me be so dramatic and carefree they're just like do you boo do you i love it whenever i've made friends with girls that have low self-esteem they try to bring me down right with them and i'm not with that so you're crazy that's all we needed to really hear at the end of the day if you are like this living I your life i surround myself with friends that just let me be so dramatic and carefree they're just like do you boo? do you <sighs> fellas <laughs> You ever met women like this that want to be the main character and no matter what they do in life, they just keep moving forward and keep making these things happen? This girl says she lives her life. She's like, she on television every single day. So you know what this means, men? If you get with a woman like this, I'm just going to throw it out there. Is she somewhat pretty? Yeah, she's somewhat pretty. But guess what? She's going to ruin your life because anytime you screw her over, guess where she's going to be? Right back here. I can only be friends with women that are full of themselves because if you... She says she can only be friends with somebody who can be full of themselves yeah this is a y'all notice something by the way tell me if you notice something before i even say it take a look at this individual picture and tell me what do y'all notice i'll give you a couple seconds all right <laughs> if you guess there's no ring on that finger you guess right young lady no ring on that finger. You can already tell. Women who talk like this, who are out around, women who are full of themselves. See, these are the kind of women who think that at the end of the day, as soon as they start hitting that 28, 29, and the, the, uh, the alarms are going off, they're going to be the first ones to think they can get any man out there, and they're just going to look around and... They're going to be out there clueless. Okay. I don't understand this whole, I want to treat my life like a television show. See, everybody wants, not everybody wants to be famous, but these girls who are attractive, they feel like they, they're going to be on TV. I want to say this right quick. Women out here who are attractive, I feel sorry for some of y'all because y'all are beautiful, right? Unfortunately, there's more of y'all than you think there is. Just because you're pretty doesn't mean you're always going to make it. And you guess what? Now, you know, pretty women back then... They used to just be like, all right, I ain't going to make it in Hollywood. I just, I'm just going to get a man. I'm going to get married, have kids, live life. Nope, not today. These women do this. I just made six figures on my only fans. They go right to OF. Now, back when I was growing up, when women were extremely attractive and they didn't want to be with a man or they said, I don't need a man, what they normally went into is real estate. I saw a lot of women who were very attractive who went to real estate because they thought they could use the looks. In fact, I knew a really attractive woman that I knew for a long time. She's in real estate now. Unfortunately, she, <laughs> she looks like every woman in real estate. They're all blonde. I'm not saying this in every area, but the area I'm talking about, they're all blonde. They all dye their hair, and they all have the same face. It's like, wow, way to just be part of nothing in your life. Anyway, so these kind of women right here, will always think they're gonna make it in life they can do no wrong really confident in yourself my world revolves around me and if you're gonna get intimidated by that we can't be friends i'm one of those people who act like i'm in a she pretty much just said if you're ugly <laughs> let's call it what it is baby she didn't really think she didn't really mean that if you're gonna be intimidated that means i'm only she, what i really heard is i'm around women who are attractive beautiful attractive women okay we know what we're worth. We're going to get it. If you're not good enough, if you don't look good, <laughs> if you're not pretty, you're not beautiful, you're not spectacular, I don't fuck with you. I don't mess with you. I don't come around you. You should stay out of this lane, okay? Don't come over here. Why is you over here? Go over there. <laughs> oh, all right, P Juice. A TV show every day, all day. And that's okay because I surround myself with friends. This part is the most wackiest thing I've ever heard. Every day, all day. We can't be friends. I'm one of those people who act like I'm in a TV show every day, all day. What does that mean? So are you saying you walk around every single day filming yourself? Or how do you act like you're on a TV show? That's what I don't understand. Like, are you fake? 
are you real? How do you act like you're on a TV show? Because even TV shows, even reality TV shows, are staged to a degree. There is some acting going on. There is not. It's not all realistic. Because real reality TV shows, there wouldn't be a whole lot going on every day. There'd be days you just come home. Hey guys, what's up? What'd you do today, man? Uh, went to the work. Went to the gym. I think I'm just gonna probably go make some YouTube videos and uh, yeah, just uh. Chill for the day, you know, nothing too crazy. Maybe watch some football. No, a reality TV show, they make it seem like every time you come home, oh, uh, yeah, I just got this one chick, I just banged her, and now she's keying my car, dude. No, that's not how it goes. So how do you mean you treat your life like this everyday TV show? That means you make up a lot of stuff. They're just, even the most famous people in the world, and they can do anything they want. Let's, let's, let's take famous people out of it. Even the most wealthiest people in the world, right? Let's just go multi-millionaires. They probably look boring to you. They're probably just going to work, coming home, going to work, coming home. That's it. That's all it is. You know, I watched the interview with Desi Banks and Shannon Sharp. And even Desi talks about he takes his craft serious. It's not just, oh, we're, I'm having fun all day. It's like, it's work. All I do is work. So to them, your life, their life may be boring to you. I just don't understand that part. How do you treat your life like it's a TV show? Oh, every day, all day. All like, day. That's okay. Because I surround myself with friends that just let me be so dramatic and carefree. They're just like, do you, boo. Do you. <laughs> Those are not friends. Those are not friends. You know what I really think this is, guys? You know, remember how we got played before? Y'all want to bet that this girl... Let's check it out. Let's go for a quick TikTok. Oh! Oh, I just got copyrighted. Gotta be careful out here, boys. Let's see what we can do. Uh, Cause I'm tired of getting played, man. I'm tired of getting played. Every time I get on here and I talk, these these women, what do they do? They lead you right to. I just made six figures on my only fans. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Never mind. We got. It looks like we got a clean individual here. Her accounts don't exist. She probably got blew up for that video. Actually, she didn't. I don't. This isn't even a popular video. So, hey, I'm a little bit on top of it today. I finally found a video that wasn't, you know, going viral. Uh, yeah, she looks, she looks, she looks fine. No, she's just a beauty girl. Cool. So we didn't get played. So that makes me feel even more justified in what I'm saying. So she really does believe this. It's not a joke. It's not satire. This is reality for her. And I get what she's trying to say. She's trying to say I'm the main character. I want to live my life as such. I get people who say I want to live my best life. The only problem is, is, unfortunately, baby girl, you're not the only person in the world. There's other people exist. You can't just live however you want. Be stupid and be dumb and be reckless and dramatic every single day. You've got to calm down. Thank you for putting the camera back on me, big dog. Okay, so, yeah, that's what I think about this. I think she's uh, absolutely crazy, you know, and it sucks for her because she is beautiful because you get other women, average women, who think they're out there like that and they can do all this stuff and they can get out here and uh, make this uh, these crazy demands. She's not making any crazy demands, but she kind of is. She's saying I don't hang out with women like that, but I bet you money she only dates men who are making a certain amount, which is fine, I don't care, but the problem is is she just being herself? But other women today, they look at women who look like this, who are very attractive, and think, you know what? I'm also I can also get what she gets. And it's like, no, baby girl, you you're not that. You ain't fine enough for no money. You get second shift at the plant. You get second shift at the plant. You don't. You're not fine enough for no money. You don't look like this. Say it again, Kevin. You ain't fine enough for no money. You're not fine enough for no money. You get second shift at the plant. That's all you get. You don't get to get her results. And once again, man, as much as I want to say that she's going to. No. When a woman is this attractive, fellas, she's going to get it. There's going to be men who are going to go after her. Until until her, her looks fade in her 30s or uh, when they're not in her 30s. A girl this attractive, probably her, her looks ain't going to fade until so she's probably 40, 45 when it starts to go downhill for her. So she's still got 15 years of men who are going to be waiting to beat down that door. <sighs> so 
I want to say she's probably not going to get a man, but that's a, I'd be a flat out lie. There's going to be men who want to date a girl like this. And I even saw a few of her pictures. She's a very beautiful individual. So she going to make it. Uh, she's just going to get out there and live it up. Y'all let me know what y'all think, though. Y'all think she's delusional? I think she's delusional for sure, living her life like she's the main ass character. But I think she's delusional as she feels like she can live that way. No. Because she can. When you're pretty... You can do you can do other stuff in this life. There's things she can probably get away with. There's stuff that she can say that she can't. But for you other women, <laughs> that's gonna be the end results for you if you try something dumb like this. The world ain't fair. There are double standards. So remember, when you start thinking you're her, remember this in your head. Just keep playing him in your head every day. We ain't finding enough for no money. You get second shift at the plant. Peace.